Good Samaritans jumped in to save the day after a violent altercation at a local bar. And the coronavirus is affecting a world famous tourist destination. I'm Marianne Cushy, and here's what's up. A night out for a group of people in Encinitas almost turned deadly after a man drove a U-Haul straight into a bar. Here's what happened. Apparently that man was kicked out of the saloon bar on South Coast Highway early Sunday morning and wasn't happy about it. Witnesses say the man jumped into the rental truck and sped down the sidewalk and ran into a bunch of people. All I hear is everyone look out and I look down towards 7-Eleven over here and this U-Haul van is just driving down the sidewalk and it's coming towards us. We all, we all jump out of the way and then it runs straight into saloon, took off the whole door and glass shattered all over us. Everybody was shocked, but many people jumped in to get the situation under control and help the three people who were seriously hurt. Others pulled the driver out of the U-Haul and held him down until sheriff's deputies got there. The driver was arrested and now faces attempted murder charges. The famous Louvre Museum in Paris has shut its doors to art lovers because of the coronavirus. People waited in long lines outside in the rain to get into the museum. There was a sign that told tourists that there might be a delay opening the museum. The reason? Workers say museum management failed to reassure staff that the risk of contagion from the coronavirus was contained, which prompted a walkout yesterday. But ultimately, for the second day, the museum was shut down. 130 confirmed cases have popped up in more than half of France's regions. A representative said that Disneyland Paris and the Eiffel Tower are both open as normal. And back here at home, a baby hippopotamus at the San Diego Zoo has finally been given a name. Meet Amashe. Her name means beautiful one in the African Zulu language. This river hippo calf was born just this last month and now weighs in at 100 pounds. This beauty is the ninth hippo calf born at the zoo and is now ready for visitors. She'll be hanging out with her mama in the hippo habitat on Tuesdays, Thursdays, and the weekends. For the very latest on COVID-19, go to NBC7.com to our coronavirus outbreak section. Hi there, I'm meteorologist Sheena Parveen. As we head through tonight, we could have a couple sprinkles left over from some afternoon showers that pass through. Otherwise, we'll be drying out overnight and tomorrow is going to be very different than today. Way more sunshine and temperatures warm up quite a bit too. Have a great day.